He's still a virgin. Who would have guessed? Come on, Matt. Hello. Hi, Matt. Ronathan calling with the corporate liaison team. How are you doing? Oh, good. Finally, how are you? I'm great, thank you. Reason for the call is that I, I've had a request here from somebody that you wanted to escalate a complaint, so uh, this has come up to me. Um, could you tell me what happened? So, I, this, this started, uh, I, I, so bottom line is I had to return, my earbuds were acting up, so I had to re- turn them back into you guys for a second time. And I did that on the 29th. I sent them back in via UPS label that you sent me. Um, they, I was wondering why, why I wasn't, I, so I got the, the confirmation email from you guys that they were sent. I was trying to figure out why I didn't get my second email from you guys. So I was looking at UPS and they were still in transit stuck in, in Arizona. Come to find out the package is now lost. So UPS said, you can't put a claim in, only Bose can put a claim in. So I contacted you guys, run around two or, two or three different people. Finally, I got somebody on um, Twitter that was helping me and just talking me through it. So we kept, we kept going through the process. And then they said, hey, I need, I need a uh, email from UPS uh, confirming that you sent the package. And I said, well, I have the tracking number and I have an email from you guys. I don't have an email from UPS because they picked it up from my place of business and I didn't, I didn't get an email or I didn't get a receipt or whatever it was. And so I've gone through all the homework with UPS. Finally, UPS let me put a claim in today. I sent um, you guys the claim number to check out today. I've sent in your email that you confirmed with me that the package was picked up and that number, I've shared the tracking number, but these things are lost. Someone obviously either took them or misplaced them or what have you, and now they're lost. And your response to me today was nothing we can do about it. Tough luck. And it's like, I'm not going to spend $250 for you guys to tell me tough luck because the package got lost. It wasn't my fault. The package got lost. And this is the second time these earbuds have been replaced. And my frustration level is probably at a nine right now because I'm just, I feel like I'm getting the runaround from Bose constantly. Last time this happened, it took a month and a half for me to get my new headphones. I travel a lot. I really like them. I want them with me because I travel. This has been a frustration for me. And no one seems to care or want to help. And I continue to do the legwork myself to try to, to rectify this. And I'm happy that you're calling me because I'm hoping you can help me here. Cause I'm it, the frustrated, like I said, I'm just super frustrated with all this. Okay. So I just taking some notes here, make sure I got full understanding of this. I can see there are already quite a few notes on here from someone in my social media team. So if I've got this right, the headphones were lost after you sent them back to us, correct? The headphones were lost after I sent them back to you. They were shipped. They got lost in Goodyear, Arizona, actually. It's on the tracking information on the UPS website. As yeah. I said, today, UPS let me put a claim in, although last week they did not. Today they did. I gave you guys the claim number of that uh, of the lost package. Okay. Um, okay. I've given you guys the the email number. You guys gave me an email number. Let me find it here. One uh, thing I'm not seeing me- on here is any kind of receipt or invoice for the uh, headphones being sent. Um, I don't know if that's missing from well, yeah, my notes. Have, have you, you sent me a self? Because you you, me- you should get a receipt when you send them back. Um, do you have so me, that? Look, Could on. you dig that Time receipt out, out me, for me? Let me explain this again. Let me explain this again to you. I work at a baseball stadium where UPS comes every day. I put them downstairs. They pick them up. I have tracking for this. You sent me an email that has your tracking on it. I sent you today a claim number that UPS said, yes, you sent these. Here's the claim number where they're lost. We'll send this to Bose right now, but I also sent it to you today. So. 
what else do you guys need besides a re- this receipt thing continues to come so, up? So, businesses- according to our procedure here, there should be some kind of receipt or invoice that you receive when you send them back, and that's the that's that's the sticky wicket here. Is we need that receipt to see to see what happened, you know. Is there any way you could dig that receipt out? Could you find that receipt? Because it is very important that we have that. I don't have a receipt. I have a receipt from you. I have an email from you with the with the receipt number. No, 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 no. This would be a receipt from the courier service from when you handed the, the so, physically handed the headphones I over to them. They, U- they give you a UPS, UPS guy will give you a receipt for that. Yeah, you you want to talk over me too. We want to talk over each other. I asked UPS for that today. Well, sir, I'm not trying to talk over you, but I'm just trying to explain to you what's going on here. Yeah, but I am, yeah, so is everybody else. So, okay, you, 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 I don't have one. I asked for one and like I got a claim number today and they said they would send it over to you and they said this will suffice, Bose, because this is the claim number. We have the pack or we don't have the package. We can't locate the package. But you sent the package, and here it is. Here's the claim number. So do you want that number? Uh, no, I've got that here in my notes, I think. Um, so are, are you saying you didn't get a receipt when you handed the headphones over? For the 15th time, I'm saying I did not get a receipt because they you were don't... picked up at our receptionist desk downstairs, and I did not receive anything, nor did she. UPS comes on a daily basis and picks stuff up from us, and I did not get a receipt. Okay, no receipt. So, yeah, I mean, I, I, I would be able to put in a formalized request to my superiors that the items were lost by the courier, but my system doesn't allow me to do that without a copy of the, the, the receipt. Okay, um, but the now, courier... What, the courier... Mm, just told me they sent you the claim number that you supposedly you have on in your notes today that will exonerate me to say that I did send the package that they lost it. So again, I'm trying to figure out why I'm being held up that I didn't get a receipt, and it's my fault that UPS lost them now, and now I'm out. Did you? Well, no, no. Uh, well, something sir, I have to send back sir, that was sir. Efficient for you guys. So, sir, I, I understand your frustration. I'm here to fix this and put this right for you. I don't know why you're, you're getting so upset with me when I'm I'm just trying my best here. Uh, I, well, I apologize, but this has been two weeks. You know, so I, I do have some built up frustration here on this whole thing. It, it sounds like you're a very frustrated young man. Yes, but I I would like to help you here and get get this resolved. Um, are you saying you definitely don't have the receipt? Yes, I am. Okay. As I said, my system doesn't allow me to proceed without having a receipt. What I could do is try and escalate this to one of my supervisors um, and provide them with all the information you've given me, and hopefully they will be able to just use their discretion to to settle this and send out a replacement pair of headphones. But as I was trying to explain while you were talking over me there, I can't... I, I, I need to kind of escalate this to a supervisor. My computer system physically doesn't allow me to proceed without that receipt. And you're sure you don't have the receipt? I do not have the receipt. They did not give me a receipt. Okay, I'm just taking some notes here to say you don't have the receipt. I want to make sure that you have all the numbers that I've provided, though. I have a Bose reference number, I have a tracking number, and now I have a claim number. Well, that I, gave me I, I believe I have all those in my notes already, but there's nothing I, I can do with those. Um, what I'd like to do is escalate you to my supervisor, if that's okay. Um, and what I'm going to do, I'm just going to put you on a very brief hold while I explain to them exactly what's going on, so you don't need to, to repeat yourself or anything. Okay, thank you. Okay, uh, let me see what I have. Oh, yeah, here we go. Yeah, so if you just hold the line for one minute, we'll be right back with you, okay? Your call is very important to us. Please hold. Okay, 
boys on Netty. Yeah. Hey, what's up, man? Is that right. Ron? Yeah, your phone broke up a little bit there, Netty. Netty, um, I've got a customer on hold uh, on line three. He can't hear us. I'm passing over the case file to your login. Um, basically, the customer sent back a pair of headphones for repair. Um, the headphones got lost by the courier, and uh, he's having a real difficult time um, because he's... Okay, so all, all we need is a receipt, and I, I can well, this, put it through. Yeah, this is the bit I don't understand. He's saying he doesn't have uh, the receipt. I don't know if he lost it or yeah, what he's so, done with the receipt. Um, but so, yeah, so the when system... when he gives the, the headphones to the courier, they should have given him a receipt. Yeah, And he has yeah, to yeah, keep that receipt yeah. until we get the headphones. Yeah, that's so the that's the bit. I, so I, I've got everything processed. If you look, I've sent you the case file number. Um, but it's stuck on the part where it asks you to upload the picture of the receipt. Do you know what I mean? Because yeah, you can't... Yeah, yeah. He, well, the he, next button the next button is grayed out. You have to upload something there. And I know the AI like can read it and everything. But I, I don't know because yeah, yeah. I've tried pressing the next button, but the next button is grayed out and it just says receipt, needs receipt. Um, yeah, so, you need the receipt. Yeah. Um, anyway, I'm. Uh, he's on line three. Just do star three, and it will come straight through yeah, to you. Yeah. I'd appreciate okay. it if you yeah, can help. Yeah, I'll pick it. it up. Thanks, Nettie. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Thank you. Hello, you're through to Ned because I'm one of the supervisors here, and Ron's already filled me in with all the details. Uh, so oh, I understand yeah. you sentenced. I'm good at yourself. I'm good, man. I'm good. Excellent. Do you want to confirm, just, just for the record, who I'm speaking with? Matthew. Perfect, perfect. And I'm Nettie Mac. And uh, so, as I understand, you sent us back a, a set of headphones, and they've gotten lost. Uh, ear, earbuds, but yes. Yes. Yes, yes. So, all we need is the receipt, and then I can, I can issue a, a refund or a replacement pair, no problem. So when, when you gave them to the courier, they'll issue you like a paper receipt. Like you got a receipt no. at like where there you go. Here's what happens at my work. Okay. I work at a baseball stadium. So UPS comes every day and I put them downstairs with our receptionist. Like I do a number of other things I send out via UPS. Did not get a receipt. They picked them up. Okay. I have a tracking number. I have an email from you guys saying they were picked up, and now I have a case number, a claim number, because I was able to put a claim in today with UPS. They acknowledge they lost them or that they can't find them at, at this point in time, and they put a claim in that I also sent to you guys as well, And but I do not have a receipt, and this is common. Like when I go, when I walk into the store, yeah, I'll get a receipt, but I didn't walk. They, they, the, the, the courier came to drop off stuff like they do every day at our facility, and they just pick up what's yeah, down yeah. there. They don't issue the receipt. So Sir, I didn't so, have a receipt. Thank you. I I understand. I understand what you're saying. So you're saying that you're just a secretary at the baseball stadium and the, the earbuds belong to someone else, and you somehow lost the receipt. Is that correct? No, the earbuds belong to me, and I so sent them back with earbuds. the label you gave me and put them downstairs okay. for her to give to the courier when he came in. That's what I'm saying. Who's her? I don't Our understand. Reception. So you're so you're the you're the receptionist. So you gave her is the the person came to pick it up. It's a female. Oh, shit. So, so, I work so when she comes to pick it up, office, and I. Yeah. Walk I understand that you're not the baseball player, you're the receptionist, right? I, I'm I understand. The rece I'm not the receptionist, but thanks thanks for that title. But I don't, I'm not the okay, receptionist. Sorry. I, you're, I you brought it up. Back. You said the receptionist. Correct. I walked sorry. Them downstairs to the receptionist to give them to her. Okay. And okay. she sent it out with the courier when he came to drop off stuff. Okay, so when the courier comes to drop off stuff, and then he also picks mm -hmm. up some stuff, he scans mm -hmm. the label. You know, we gave you the label. 
So when he scans yeah. the label, it prints out a receipt from his scanner. I like maybe you don't know how so, this works because you're not a receptionist. I, I, I did not. So Long the receptionist story, I didn't get a receipt, gets a receipt, and I've done this. She doesn't have the receipt, so she doesn't have the receipt. What I have is the tracking number that it, it was. What I have is the claim number. And I have your number. I don't have a receipt, so that's I just don't. I don't have it. I don't have. Is a it possible a to go back to the stadium and get the receipt? Can you go back to the stadium and get the receipt? Holy fuck! The stadium well, doesn't. I work at the, the stadium. We don't have. There is no yeah. receipt. The, so the the receptionist, she must have kept the receipt for you. She's doing a good job for you, I think. Can you call her? Do you have her phone number? To call her and ask about the receipt because I don't feel like you have Isn't searched that, for the receipt at all, sir. You don't. You say that. Say that last part again. I'm sorry. I'm not sure if you have searched for this receipt at all. Have you uh, even actually, looked I for have, it? Have you asked her around? Last week. This came up last week, so yes, I have searched for it. I even called UPS today. And they said, you don't need a receipt. I'm going to give you a claim. You're going to put a claim in. I'm going to give you this claim number, which they did. So. Yeah, the claim number is good, but it's not the receipt. Okay. Uh, so I don't have a receipt. So what do we do now? Am I just out the money now and I'm just screwed? Like, because I'm like, that's worst case scenario here, which is. So I'm so angry this last uh, couple of weeks. Could like, you check? Ridiculous. Could you check? Do you have the the receipt number at least from the receipt? If like if you have the receipt number, then I can get <laughs> reprint. If you have the receipt I number, have, if she jotted it down, I don't have the receipt number. We didn't get a receipt, bud. I can't keep. I don't know what else to tell you. Like I know you asked in a bunch of different ways. I don't have a receipt. I have what I what I told you I have. So yeah, um, I mean, you I have, have a receptionist. It's not collecting receipts, is what you have. It sounds to me. Um, yeah, that's probably it. You're right. So what what we might be able to do is with the claim number, um, one of the senior managers might be able to put that through. Um, I think I think I have a Hazel available. Um. I'm not sure what a Hazel yeah, is. Yeah, so, so Hazel, Hazel's, Hazel's a senior manager. Uh, so oh, okay. all of the notes from, from our conversation and from your and Ron's conversation earlier are all in the system. So I can pass you on to Hazel, and she can try and issue it through the claim number, if that's okay with you. And I apologize. I, I was told that you had the receipt by Ron. I don't know what was... You made a mistake, I I think. Can I put you on hold for just a minute? I'll put you on with Hazel. Sure. Thank you so much. Your call is very important to us. Please hold. Please hold. Your call is very important to us. Please hang up. Please hold. Please hold. Please hold. Please hold. It's a great day. This is Hazel speaking in Escalations. How may I help you today? It looks Hi, like Hazel. Actually, how are you? Hi. How are you? It looks like I'm speaking with uh, Matt. Yes, you are. Thank you. Hey, Matt. So it looks like you uh, are wanting to... Uh, do you, you have a claim number for me? Yeah, I'm kind of in a mess here. It's a two-week mess that is blown like way up and oh. yes i have a claim number if you want me to share that with you I'm so, so uh, sorry to hear that quick. i don't know what the previous gentleman told you but i'm happy to answer any questions that you have but oh. basically 
the headphones needed to be returned. I got the label, sent them out, got a tracking number, got confirmation email from you guys. And then, you know, a week had gone by and didn't hear back from you guys. So I looked up the tracking number and the package was stuck in Goodyear, Arizona. And I thought, well, what's going on? Contacted UPS. They said, well, you need to contact Bose. They can put a claim in. So I contacted Bose. That didn't go anywhere. Finally, today, I was able to put a claim number in with UPS. And now everyone today is in last week too, saying, hey, you got a receipt. You got a receipt. I said, no, I don't have a receipt. This were, these were picked up from work um, like an UPS normally does, but I didn't get it. I normally don't get receipts. I didn't get a receipt for this. And I'm mad that I didn't at this point. Um, that would have made life so much easier. It sounds yeah, like. Yeah, you should always get a receipt. Um, but I do have a, say that again. You should always get a receipt, but let's keep going. Well, I've learned that through this process, but, <laughs> but yes. Um, and typically I do like, you know, when you go there, when you go into the store, I typically do, but this was, they were, they picked up from us and that normally doesn't happen with us. But anyways, so I put the claim in today. They acknowledge they lost the package or can't find it at this moment and that they would be sending this over to Bose, but they gave me the claim number. They told me it okay. would be resolved by Wednesday. Oh, I'll take care I of this for you. I could, and yeah, I'll, I don't know I'll what take to care do of this. other than that. Sorry, were you talking? Uh, I apologize. No, I say I'm going to take care of this for you right away. Do you have that claim number? Yeah, it's um, it's okay. So I put that into my um, um, into my notes, I and have then a I just memory. need the your is memorized in my mind. I just need I just need uh, your receipt if you have that handy. I I. I said that I don't have a receipt. Oh, do you, I don't need the receipt. Do you have the receipt number? I don't have the receipt number. I don't have any. No, I don't have. I have a oh. tracking number. I have a Bose number from your email oh. thing. It got picked up. I don't Sorry. have a receipt, a receipt number, anything like uh, that. Okay. Do you, did anyone have eyes on that receipt? Holy moly. No. No one had eyes so who on would have receipt. signed for it or who would have been the person who had the receipt? No one would have the receipt because they pick up stuff. All the, I don't have a receipt. Who, who was there when up, the package was it. signed for? It wasn't signed for. It was just picked up, but the receptionist would have given the package to the UPS oh, driver. She must have the receipt. Along with a number of other packages that went out that day, because we have a lot of packages that go out every day. That's why they come she every must, day. So. Is she available? Is she available? Mm -hmm. She doesn't have the receipt because I've asked her for it because this came up last week and she said no. Okay. Do you have any photographic evidence of the receipt? I don't. I never saw a receipt, so no, I don't have any screenshot. Photo, no. no. Hmm. You don't think it's lying around anywhere? How come the claim number doesn't work in this case, I guess? Because the claim number is for, uh, is that's an internal number for the courier. I need a receipt that goes back to our organization to put the two together. I can't just do it with one number. So you don't have a receipt. Um, no. Okay. Um Hmm. Yeah, I'm you on know UPS. What? I'm like, I have the tracking number. It doesn't say, it doesn't have a receipt number on here anywhere either. So I've okay. looked through you this. Know I'm what, looking at sir? it again right now. I, I'm going to, I know what to do. I know how to solve this. I have your career receipt. I am going to call the driver and I will get him to, he'll have a copy of the receipt this okay. was like two weeks and ago, so hopefully that's he does. okay. That'd they have great. it all on their on their iPad on their iPads. I've done this before, and it worked, and it's okay. the best way great. to do it. So you know what? If you want to hold, I am just let me put your number in. We have a back door into the UPS. Okay, I'm just. Well, you're this gonna should be my go. Hero in a minute. Uh, this will go right to the driver and we're going to be able to take care of this for you right away, Matt. Just one moment. I'm just going to patch the driver in. The 
This is Mike. Oh, hi, Mike. My name's Hazel, and I'm calling with Bose. Um, I, I actually spoke to you last week or two weeks ago, and you were very helpful. So I hope you don't mind me calling back. It's from the same route, so I think you're, you can you can meet. Okay, I have a customer. I'm I'm just. Uh, can I text you at the number you gave me when I spoke to you before? I think I can find it. His UPS number. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. His name is Matt Larose, and he had something He's picked up that was yeah. Just that he he had something that was being picked up from us. It looks like uh, Mr. Larose, you work at a stadium of some sort. If I'm looking at this yeah, correctly. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, Southwest University Park there in the downtown. Southwest yeah. University. Okay. University. Yep, yep. So, did you get that number I just sent you? Yeah, hold on. I got a stack of receipts here. Let me. Yeah. Let me if you, I just wonder if you can take that number and cross-reference it and give me the receipt number, then I can help out Matt immediately with his issue. Is that something you can do for us, sir? No problem. No problem. Hold oh, on. thank you so much. Yeah, thank you, sir. This is fantastic. Let's go. Okay, hold on. Here's my stadium stack. Okay, here we go. Hold on. Hold on, sorry. Hold on. Okay, here we go. I got... Okay, I got a receipt number. Is this for... It's a small box going to Bose from the stadium. Yes. Does that sound right? Okay, yeah. Here, are uh, you ready, Hazel? I got the number. Terrific. Go ahead. All right, it's two, seven. Two, seven. Six, five, it's a kind of long number. It's two, okay. seven, six, five. Two, seven, six, five. Four, one, three. Four, one, three. Hold on, this guy's beeping at me. Hold on. Oh, oh, oh. Jesus. Are oh, you no. driving and doing this at the same time? You better I, be careful, please. My windows were open. I just lost half the stack of papers. Hold on, let me see. Oh, oh, hold on. Hold on, let me pull over. Holy moly. Oh, I just lost the seat. Oh, just, be careful. The, the receipts flew out the window. I got a whole stack of them just flew out my window here. The window's open. It's kind of windy. Oh, man. Uh, did you get the numbers I gave you? I. Not there were like a, six left. I, I, I didn't get the last six, obviously. Oh, let me see. I'm looking. God, it's so windy. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to find it. Let me see. These people are all pissed off at me here. No. I got. I can't. It's really hard to pull over, but I'm going to try rounding around here. I'm going to round around the block and see if I can see the stack. Cause it, it's really windy out here. Hold on. Let me look at what I got left. Yeah, no, this, I, it must have been in the stack that blew out. Let me pull over here, or pull around the corner here. Oh, my God. I only need six more numbers, the last six. Here, let me see. I think I got a carbon copy. Okay, I can look at this carbon copy, too. Oh. Jesus! Ah. Michael, are you okay? What? Oh my God, yeah. Michael! Oh. Michael, can't be. this can't be, Michael. You guys are putting me on here. This are you crazy. okay? Is this what is going on? <laughs> oh, I gonna call an ambulance or nine one one. Where are you? Can you call nine one one on your phone, Michael? Oh my God! Should I call UPS? Head off. See, I can't reach the phone. See, I can't reach the phone. Call some. Call help. Okay. Okay. Jennifer, can you get in my office? I'm gonna look at get Jennifer in my office right now. Can you get those receipts? You. Can you I'm grab those phone. receipts before they say, get those receipts, sir? Please. 
I'm in the middle of a call. I need you to get those receipts, please. Grab that. Grab it right there, right there, right there. No, no, no. <laughs> oh, come on. Get the receipts. I'm in the middle of a call. I need your location. Michael? I'm worried about this. I'm trying to get these receipts. Can you hold on? I'm trying to get these receipts. Sure. I know this is a big deal. Hold on. Sure. I can't feel my arm. Oh. Oh. Michael, are you okay? I think help is on the way. Get those receipts! Pick those up. I need them real quick before they put me in here. I need to give my boss these receipt numbers. Sir, don't worry about the receipt. We've got to find your left. It's the... They're going to blow away, well man. Michael, well don't done. worry about the receipts. Just take care of yourself. Don't, don't worry. Don't worry about the receipts, sir. <laughs> well done. Well done. <laughs> Mike, did you get those receipts yet? We need to know. I'm working on it. Mike. Look, I, I don't want any excuses, Mike. Okay. Legs or no legs. You find that receipt now. We need that receipt number. That's not nice. He's been in an accident. Yeah, well, not my problem. Not my problem. This guy needs his receipt now. <laughs> I was the first oh responders. You guys pumped me. Good See job. if the first responders will help you look for the receipt. <laughs> Good job, guys. Hey, can you go get that bag? <laughs> Just grab those before they go away. There's that wet one down there. Get that one. In light of the circumstances, I may just send you um, a replacement pair of the Bose earbuds. I feel. I got it. Oh, amazing. It's. Uh, I'm kind of staying here. I got it. The last six. Seven. Stay with it's us, Mike. Charged. Stay with us. Give us those numbers. Seven. Seven, two. Two. Nine. What? Seven, seven, two, nine. That's not even our numbers. Seven. Don't go toward the light, Michael. Give me the last three numbers. Three numbers. Uh, no. I mean, Michael. Uh, Matt, look what you did. Matt, look what you did. I know. It's, <laughs> oh what have you God. done? You guys are so good. What have you done, Matt? Oh, a pair of All headphones. this over some headphones. He had a family, you know. Had. Had a family. They won't want him now. They won't want him now that he has no legs. Have you ever had to wheel around a, w amp a double amputee, Matt? What it's kind of delivery fun. driver has no legs? I don't know I why you're laughing. It's misfortune. An unemployed yeah, one. Close and personal. Unbelievable. So. Unbelievable. So what are we doing, guys? Um, oh, okay. I don't know what to do here. Do you right. have? Do you, do you? Can you look on your phone and see if you might have taken a picture of? The if we don't have that fucking remember? receipt, I don't know what to do. I mean, we've tried every avenue here with this receipt, and it's not happening. I don't have the receipt, well, we, guys. I just don't. I don't know what else to say. I have everything else that you asked for. I just don't have the receipt. But do you? Are you sure you don't have the receipt? I don't have the receipt. <sighs> Oh, my God. It's for sure not on your phone? You didn't snap a quick picture of it or anything? I didn't. What do you do over at the stadium? Receipt. So are you like the mascot? Do you, like, dress up as a bear or something? I, I do. But, guys, come on. Either we're going to either you're going to... Either you're going to take care of this or you're not at this point. Like, no, we're going to take care of it. We're going to take care of it. Sure. Yeah, of don't course, worry. We're, we're definitely going to take care of it. As soon as we get this receipt, we are in business. So if yeah. you can just look for that receipt, uh, that'd be great. Uh, we're can you Mike, run back to the stadium and, and check in the dumpster if maybe it's in there somewhere? Just dump, I have a dumpster pornographic dive memory. Matt? The receipt is memorized Matt? in my mind. There he goes. Finally, he's off the phone. Fucking hell. <laughs> I was going to say, Michael did not die in vain. We're going to get that receipt. Well, Michael, I'm sorry you had to die there, Michael, just for a Michael. receipt. Michael. 
Sorry about your legs. He died in pain for his job that he loved.